Today, what's uh, can you tell us a little bit about the park? What's going on out here? Well, the art park. We have almost two miles of hiking trails lined with art created by Michigan artists, uh, all inspired by Michigan history or culture. And this year, we're doing a special environmental art project honoring the men that worked in the logging industry. It's called the Pine Cone Forest, and these are some of the things we're stringing pine cones together and they'll be hung in the park in a certain area to create a forest. So everybody's invited to come out and create a, a string of pine cones and contribute to our forest. Welcome to Rivers and Coffee. What a beautiful amphitheater. This morning, I'm out at the Michigan Legacy Art Park within the Crystal Mountain Resort in Thompsonville, Northern Michigan. It's absolutely beautiful. It's about a 30 acre piece of property with a mile and a half, two miles worth of trails running through it, intermixed with some beautiful pieces of art. Art, history, nature, and a little bit of exercise. What more could you ask for? Let's take a walk and check out some of the pieces of art.
Now that's super cool. There's so much to see out here. There's no way that you can do it in one visit. I'm definitely gonna have to come back out uh, probably in the fall when the leaves change. I think it'll be spectacular. Some beautiful views as well. I think that's the uh, Betsy River Valley. Not sure, don't quote me on that. I'm like a little kid out here. So much fun and so many things to see. When I started the hike, I was so excited. I left my backpack in my truck. No coffee and no water. How can Rivers and Coffee leave his coffee behind? When I get done with this hike, I gotta scoot back there and get myself a little bit of water. Man, that was a lot of fun. I'm back to where I started. Took the uh, the trail, it's about a mile and a half. Absolutely beautiful. Hardwood forest, topography in the art. Spectacular, well-maintained trails. This facility is run by a nonprofit group. Uh, there's a $5 entry fee. I don't believe there's an entry fee for for uh, kids. It's on, your, on the honor system. Make sure you help those folks out if you get an opportunity. Again, it's very well run, beautiful facility and you can't see it all in one visit so i'm definitely coming back you won't be disappointed if you make the trip okay remember get outside take a little time for yourself find a little peace everybody deserves a little peace in their life until next time rivers and coffee don't forget your water okay peace